Well, the impact of the wildfire certainly stretches beyond Bastrop. It is also hitting the nearby community of Smithville. Yeah, we're now learning just how many students and staff in the Smithville School District have been directly impacted by the fires. KXAN's Aaron Cargyle has that story from Bastrop County. Good afternoon. Today, the Smithville ISD superintendent described the students as sweet, compassionate, and resilient, and said staff members have been extremely positive in spite of the horrible experience they have been through. Out of the 100 students in Smithville ISD who had to evacuate, we know about 42 lost their homes. Another nine staff members have no home to go back to. Now, that positivity is the same environment teachers in Bastrop have described. We went into classrooms yesterday at a mill elementary where 82 students and 10 teachers lost their homes. Part of the healing is getting back to a regular routine and being with their school family. A second grade class decorated a large poster that said, We are Bastrop. Students drew pictures of their families, fire, and water being poured on the flames. Even though several students and teachers lost their homes, positive attitudes filled the school. It's been emotional, um, ups and downs, but you know, I'm so proud of them and they're just so strong and so caring and they've been working together so well and just so much love today. And school bus drivers are still stopping at local hotels and shelters to pick up students displaced by the fire. Bus drivers in Smithville are driving as far as LaGrange and Giddings to pick up students who are staying with family and friends there. The Austin School District also tells us a handful of students have been enrolled by families who are in the Austin area. In Bastrop, Aaron Cargyle, KXAN News.